हेलो फ्रेंड्स गुड मॉर्निंग गुड आफ्टरनून गुड इवनिंग सो दिस इज अबाउट इंटीग्रेटेड पीजी और इंटीग्रेटेड एमटेक प्रोग्राम इन वीआईटी वेल्लोर एंड लॉट ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स हैव आस्ट अबाउट द रिव्यू फॉर दिस सो दिस कोर्स इज अवेलेबल इन द वीआईटी वेल्लोर मेन कैंपस एंड इट हैज आल्सो गॉट डिसेंट अमाउंट ऑफ प्लेसमेंट्स सो आई एम गोइंग टू कवर द कंप्लीट डिटेल विथ रेस्पेक्ट टू इंफॉर्मेशन प्रोवाइडेड इन द मैंडेटरी डिस्कलोजर डॉक्यूमेंट ऑफ दिस यू नो कोर्स so let's first see the seat matrix available for post graduate and the integrated pg program right which is integrated mtech programs so branches available are like uh, biotechnology and computer science engineering uh, with specialization in data science computer science engineering and some of the mtech fields like uh, power electronics and drives automotive electronics and then some of the engineering uh, five year programs like biomedical engineering industrial design which is mdes program and automotive engineering and vrsi design has highest 126 seats so if you, similarly if you want to know the uh, other uh, mtech or integrated mtech courses which are available is mechatronics 36 seats computer science engineering with specialization in information security 18 seats embedded systems some 60 seats mechanical engineering with uh, specialization in cyber physical systems that is also around 54 seats and csc with specialization in artificial intelligence and machine learning 72 seats so good number of seats there there is a uh, integrated mtech which is there for software engineering row number 24 so software engineering integ integrated mtech has highest number of seats 480 so this is one of the most demanding branch and it has the highest seats also 480 seats in one single branch of mtech integrated mtech computer science engineering with data science that also integrated mtech 240 seats are there right and then you see computer science engineering with integrated mtech 120 seats and you see ec with intelligence communication those are 18 seats understand that there are large number of integrated mtech seats also available right and what is the total number of seats so i am again referring to the nirf document nrf 2024 document and if you see there are three rows ug 4 year pg 2 years and pg integrated 5 years so i am only talking about pg integrated 5 years you can see the total number of seat was 900 seats right so you so sufficient amount of seats are there 900 seats now it has also increased to 1080 seats you can see year wise different seats are mentioned in the nirf document from the past year to the latest year so now let's also see the placement how it has happened in the integrated mtech course which is a five year program so if you can see that there is a table which shows in 2021 passing batch there were 632 students out of which 410 got placed so placement was quite low and the median salary was only 4.5 lakh rupees but if you see in the next year the total eligible students in 2022 was 683 out of 683 565 students got placed which is good improvement and a good placement percentage also so median salary also increased to 7 lakhs which is quite decent and in 2023 batch again 502 students were eligible and out of which 454 got placed with the median salary of 7 lakhs so median salary is 7 lakhs but placement little bit got dropped last year and um, 454 students got only placed so that's our overall so it's a decent option if you are not getting btech courses then you can also go for integrated mtech courses but again the placement median salary will be lower and um, overall placements will be like 50 to 70% you can expect in every year 50 to 70% students get placed so you have to take good branches only in the integrated mtech not take don't take any other branches right which are like a core branches so that's a update thanks for watching and please do subscribe channel to get similar updates on all the colleges in karnataka and india take care and bye